at cb24.com. Steve? Uh, Nalini, thank you very much. Um, she's had a remarkable career. She is a two-time Emmy-nominated actress. Uh, she is an entrepreneur. She studied at Ryerson. She's been a star since 1990 of uh, YNR, and she's also the originator of uh, something we're going to talk, talk about this morning, which is the Real World Film Festival. Tanya Lee Williams is with us. Good morning to you. Good morning to you. Yeah, and I brought up the Ryerson part and the Toronto part is because um, when we have people, famous people coming in here, we always are apologizing for the weather or something. But, but this is, you know what I mean? Like this kind of thing. Be used to it. Yeah, you're just used to it. Your mom still lives here? Absolutely, yeah. yeah okay. Yeah. All right. Um, before we get to why well, you're really here, mm -hmm. the Real World Film Festival, we've got to talk about Y&R. Sure. Um, so it's celebrating 40 years. Is like that astonishing for you that something could stay? My grandma stories could stay on this long? I know. It's yeah. fantastic, actually. That I mean, in this business where everything, you know, it's, it's, it's old after six months, <laughs> the fact that something can be that sustainable, mm -hmm. it's, a, it's kudos to them, really. I want to ask you what's the most evil thing you've ever done, but maybe you've never, on the show. <laughs> not, not, in, not in real life, by the way. Just 30 but minutes ago when I was... <laughs> that's right. You remember what I did, Steve. Um, his, your character, how has your character changed since the very beginning, and how much influence did you have on changing the character versus the, uh, the writers? Um, I think you can't help but have an influence in changing the character, only because you, you, you're living with it for so long, and whatever the dialogue is, you're going to make your own attitude in it. So, yeah. It's, yeah it's, I, do, I have to say this on TV. My wife and I when we first got together. Right. We watched Y and R. <laughs> I know it was you really watching and she just kinda you know, no, she no. just kinda looked a no. little no. fell in love with it. Um, so moving forward from, from Y and R because while you're here, yeah. why in the world would you as an actress think that you should um, start a film festival and the real world film festival is international in the sense that it brings together all kinds of cultures. Absolutely. Okay. Well first you'd have to be crazy. Yeah. And and I am. So that that was the beginning part of it. But I think um, the fact that I was a person of color and worked in the industry for as long as I have and um, you know being invited to places to talk about the industry I noticed a lot of young people had a lot of questions which I am limited in what I can answer and it started to I, I love going to film festivals and I love how much information that you can get for so many different perspectives and people and I thought what a great platform especially the fact that I wanted to focus on the Aboriginal Asian black Latino, Middle Eastern, mm -hmm. South Asian communities. That is a huge growing community in Canada, especially here in Toronto. And uh, thought they should have an opportunity to tell their own stories. Okay, opening night is? Contract. Yeah. Very excited movie from Ghana. Um, closing night movie, Anna Cabana, which is a great Bollywood movie. Still great tickets left. Want people to come out. We've got Tangie Miller's in town, brought her up. She's got the real speak happening tomorrow beautiful movie from Guadalupe called Elsa and the right. director is going to be here. She's the first female uh, director from Guadalupe, so very wow. exciting. Okay, people can get tickets. Yeah, www.real, R-E-E-L, realworld.ca, okay. and uh, come on down, Canada okay. Square, mm -hmm. and uh, pick tickets up right there. This is, uh, this is wonderful and has helped a lot of people along the way. Some people like are talented as they are, but they need a little prop up with something like Absolutely. this to expose their materials. Yes. Yeah. That's, uh, it's wonderful to have you here. Oh, and, thank you. Uh, and um, mm -hmm. I, hopefully, I'm going to say this, hopefully YNR stays on for another, another 40. 40 years. <laughs> And maybe you'll still be on it. Maybe, or or maybe not. <laughs> but you'll be a retired person on the show, yeah, yeah. won't you as well? <laughs> Tony Lee Williams, thank you so much for uh, being thank here. Thank you. And I don't, you don't need luck. This has been going on. It's been very successful for years to come. Thank you. All right, uh, we will return. This is CP24 Breakfast. Some milestones, some smiles in just a few. It's eight fifteen.